Now, in this video, we'll see how to create a jar file in IntelliJ. There are basically two ways of creating a jar file. So, the first method is to go to files. Before going to files, once you open your uh, untitled project, there won't be any resources here called out. So, once you create a jar file, a, f a separate file should be created with the name of out. If it is not created, your jar file is not created. So now, let's move on to the first procedure. Go to File and click on Project Structure. So here, you can see modules, libraries, facets, artifacts. Under Artifacts, click on Artifacts. Then you can see this plus button right here. Click on the plus button. Click on Jar. Once you click on Jar, select from Modules with Dependencies. Here, main, in main class, you should give the name of your project. Click right here. So, it will search for the project that is present. Select this. And then click OK. Make sure you click Apply. And then close this window. So, after this, go to Build. There will be this option called Build Artifacts. Click on it. And then click Build again. So you can see the jar is getting built. Now when you open the, expand your uh, project, you can see that a new file called Out is created. And a jar is also created. So the name of our jar is Untitled File. So the second way to create a jar is, so imagine if you make some changes in the same code. So imagine I don't want 5 here. I want 455. So after this, we want the jar with this value. So you, we need not follow every single step we followed now. We can do it in a simple manner where you can click Maven here. And then there is this option called Execute Maven Goal. Click this, here type MVN, clean, install, click on MVN clean install, enter, wait for it to run. So now, once you can see your build is success, it means that this particular change is added to the jar with the same name. And that's pretty much it with creating a jar. To access the same jar, you can go to the same file where it is created and then you can access it. That's pretty much it about this video. If you have any doubts in creating the jar, make sure you drop a comment.